And we're back at Super Caesar's Palace, where I'm looking for the buffet. Uh, but there doesn't seem to be one. Like, this is, like, C Caesar's Palace is huge, isn't it? This seems so small, with so many less people, and way less smoking. Like, you would, like, this is the 90s. There should be people smoking everywhere. Instead, you've got these assholes here, with your dumb haircut. Morning already! Time flies when you're having fun. I gotta go, see ya. Like, okay. Why'd they even put that in? I feel like this game is the SNES... He's gone. This is the SNES <laughs> equivalent of shovelware. Like, that's the stupid Wii games that you get that, that no one likes. Which ones? Like, um... Like, like Wii Sports? No, that one's, a, that one's fun. Or, or, uh, or, or like, The Legend uh, of Zelda? With like, the... No, because that's a fun game, too. Like, we're talking, like, um... Game Party 2! Or... Chicken egg throw! Or stupid, stupid dollar Wii games that you find everywhere. I don't know. I'm gonna show you probably part of one of the best parts of this game. Coffee? Sorry. <laughs> you can buy scratch tickets. Oh yeah. You got 60 yard fight, match two, and triple jacks. We're gonna play 60 yard fight. Alright. So I guess the point of this game is to go 60 yards. Uh, scratch one space on each side of the yard line, starting at t the 10, working your way up. Money amounts to increase, but so do the bombs. Um, stop whenever you want to collect your current amount. So, 10. All right. 50. Okay. Doesn't cover my $100 cost. Bomb. And you kind of like... So apparently you can go up to $1,500 in all these things. I would have been happy just making it up to two hundred dollars. All right, let's do this again. I want there to be like a button where you get mad and you punch the ATM and the security guard comes and like asks you to leave because you're being out of control. <laughs> All right. H have you ever gotten to fifteen? Oh yeah, no, I played this. God, but I suck at it so hard. Look at that. There's literally only like one spot I could have hit there. Alright, let's do this one more time. This is how you go broke in Vegas. All it takes is one more to hit to the top. Because if I get at 60, 60 up there, I'm back in the game. Alright, there's 10. There's 50. Where, where do I look at here? Right here? <laughs> Three in? Right here? Oh, fuck! <laughs> what have I told you about touching <gasps> Mama Scratch tickets? <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. I am the worst. L look at that. I would have been just fine. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, let's try our luck somewhere else. Let's try um, a match two. Alright. Match two. Scratch symbols until two match. Win that amount. This one kind of sucks because you could get like $25 and match two of those. And then you win that, even though this costs... I never win at this one. But you can win up to $2,500, so, like, if you're lucky, I'm going to try it again. <laughs> if you're lucky, you can come out on top. You seem to keep getting 25 as your first. Oh, 25? I mean, at least you didn't lose as much as you could have. Well, let's scratch the entire ticket. Yeah, that sucks. Okay, so I'm out 75 bucks. Ooh, big spender. I won $25 on a $100 lotto ticket. Who the hell says $100 scratch-off tickets? All right, 50. Well, I mean, I... I Bump! I, fuck! I, I feel like... I, 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 I've never actually bought this scratch it. I'm not sure if they have uh, 2,500 rewards on them. Oh, I'm sure you can... You win for like 10 grand on scratch-off tickets now. Oh. Yeah. All right, triple jacks. I gotta beat the dealer's hand. Hmm. He's got a pair. Oh, okay. If I beat the dealer, I get 150. If I have a pair, 200 or something. Okay. King. Four. Okay, I guess I can keep going. Eight. Oh. How do I... How do I, how do I, how do I do it? How do I, what button do I press? I have one. Press B to scratch the entire ticket. Okay. 
manual scratching. See, there aren't even three jacks on it, but I could have gotten three sevens. That would have been cool. All right, let's see this again. Yeah, I was just thinking about like whether they rig it at, on any of the games so you or so it's literally impossible to beat it. Oh, I'm sure they do. Let's, let's try this one. Twenty-five. <laughs> Cherry. <laughs> Mule. So the, the question is: So what are those dots, like in the corner of? Are those? Oh, this is art to make it look like an actual ticket. Yeah, I realize this is sixteen bits. Sixteen bit graphics. This is high. This is high technology. I swear, God, it's twenty five dollars. I, I can't. Yeah, I, I, I think it was like, was it Wolfenstein three D? That'd be a fun game to play. I don't have that one yet. But uh, but I actually watched a thing about how like, even though it says three D in the title, it's definitely not three D. Well, I mean, it's like really complex two D rendering. Yeah. Well, I mean, it was complex two D rendering even in DOS back when it was a DOS game. So, you know. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get them three jacks. There's a king. There's a ten. All right, I've beaten the dealer. This seems like the game to play if you just want to, like, nickel and dime the dealer to death. Okay, I'm at a pair. So that's $200. Uh, three cards straight. Four, five, six. That is... I'm gonna... Alright, hold on. How do I cash this out? B? Is it for... for... No... It said, there we go. Yeah! Okay, so there. let's do that again. This is how we're going to win our money. Triple jacks! I, I'm just thinking about, like, learning if there's any way by the way that the game is actually coded to exploit the... Uh, the yeah, he you just, you just run safe states. I mean, we were using the Retron. True. All right, so eight, nine, jack, six. Yeah. I've already beaten the dealer. Four. Yeah. Oh, b b b bomb! I, I think that even with like when online gambling was like first kind of coming around, that people essentially what they did is that the uh, the gambling sites weren't seeding their sort of uh, random number generator. So people were predicting what uh, what that would come out insane. and winning pretty easily. And they finally mentioned it. They're like, hey, you should probably change this about your system now that we're walking away with like a fat stack of money. I wish I was walking away with a fat stack. I'm not even walking away with a fat stack of digital money. <laughs> Fuck! God, these... Ugh! You know what I should have done? Because you should have just turned on cheats. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. My password is... Numbers. Alright, let's... Do you ever write that down? Like, do you ever cross-reference that? Well, I mean, it's the future. Like, you don't have to now. You can just screenshot it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, a nice little, like, feature that I really liked with the with the 3DS was the fact that there actually was, like, a little notepad internally in the system that you could you know, switch, switch over to in games. Mm -hmm. So I would make, you know, notes for the games and stuff like that. I mean, since it's a handheld system, it has a little bit more limitations in terms of screen capping. Yeah? yeah. Shit. Alright, all or nothing? <laughs> all or nothing? Let's do all or nothing. <laughs> that, um... Let's do it. Let's do all or nothing. Yeah! Oh, I could split, but I have no extra money. This guy better be holding a four. Mm. And you know what? He's back on top. Back again. With all the cash. <laughs> Alright. All or nothing. I feel like if you keep doing this. Oh, 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 look at that though. Give me a 10. Alright, 18. Yes! Uh, uh. I've got the money. I've got the money. If you all or nothing enough times, are you just going to like... Oh, no, I'll definitely lose. But now I'm just going to stand here and enjoy this hot jam. 
There are other games to check out, but I think that I'm just going to waste all my money on that. So let's try this again. Cliff Tray. What's Cliff Tray? What? I've never played this. Oh no! This is a $500 table. I think there is a more expensive table. I need to blow a fat stack! And blow this fat wad. Catch me drift. Yeah. There you go. Ten grand. Alright. Um. Oh. Wait. I was not the button I wanted to press. Is, is, is Pokemon Go still, still a relevant thing? I guess. I mean. But not really. I don't know. I don't play it. Because like, I was just thinking about like Vegas and like churches and stuff. Just the way that the, the algorithm. Okay, uh, wait, hold on. Even, 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 even. Yes! Uh, God, I'm so good at this game. I'm not actually that good at this game. But I made eight grand. I came here with two grand. And. No, I don't want that. I came here with two grand. I dicked around a little bit. And I'm walking out. This is how you do Vegas, people. This is how you do it. You come with some cash. You play some scratch-off tickets, you wear a stupid fucking tie, and then at the end of the day, the security guard goes, Where are you going? And you say, Time to head out. Got it right here in my pocket, baby. I don't have it in my pocket. I, don't. I guess I can watch this video. I don't know. Um, alright. Oh, no, nope, didn't change my mind. And we got this beautiful cutscene. <laughs> Anyways, I really like this game. Um... It's a good time killer. I've actually, like, I'll play this, like, watch a movie and I'm not into it. I'll play something like this on the side. Or, like, you know, I'm at work. You get the Superboy out, the little handheld Super Nintendo, you play this. Um, I guess they have this game on the Game Boy, too. I've never played it, though, on the Game Boy. I really should, though. It'd be really fun, actually. Um, yeah, it's a Super Caesar's Palace. Not a super complicated game. Nice. Not a super complicated game, not an expensive game, uh, not a lot to it, and definitely not even enough for more than two episodes. So, um, thanks, thanks for watching, I guess. All right. Catch you later.